Susan Bot, please spare me. I just love Star Wars. What a do, Buddha Crew, it is your boy Finesse B here, back with episode 4 of 7 of Scoot Wars Week! Woo! Mate, forget the uh, exotic cars, okay? Forget your luxury homes, your mansions. Forget your iPhone XR, okay? Today we're looking at the best, okay? The goodest, the most sickest, the most expensive custom pro scooters that I could find within our couple of submissions here. So, uh... That might be a little bit of an over-exaggeration, but anyway, I'm gonna do it for the metadata, so you can just suck my thumb. Let's jump in! Hello, Scootering Bradley. I just painted my scoot, and it looks muy bonito! Does that mean very good? I'm just gonna double check that in case you made me say something offensive. Very pretty. Mm -hmm, close enough. I thought you were gonna try and make me say something like Me pene is muy pequeño, but me pene is muy grande. He said, I'm very excited! Is nice! I like! ODI grips, core Apollo titanium bars, I was about to say T-bars, it's just a force of habit. Tilt Arc SCS clamp, Tilt X friendly headset, Ethic Miro forks, Ethic Action wheels, which are the cool twin core ones, as you can see here. I really like the look of these wheels, they're very, very futuristic, mate. Absolutely beautiful photos, mate. Farzan, half-painted deck, which looks very nice. He's obviously done that himself. Good job. It uh, really matches the fork and clamp here, which is very cool. And uh, also the Scoot Store grip tape. Hope you like it. If you want to see riding clips, follow me on IG at Armasvarenma. Smile. Next! Hey Scooter Brad, I'm Blake. I'm 17 years old from New Zealand. Chair, but I live in Finland. Ah, it's a long story. Lameo. Anyway, here's my Buddha. I hope you like it, and I think you're in for a surprise. Oh, okay. Okay, alright. ODI aluminium bar ends. Ethic grips, black and white mixed. Ethic trianton bars in black. Wise SCS clamp with factory misprint. Surpr that's the surprise. Oh, okay, I see it. <laughs> the bed they got printed upside down. That's tight, actually. Uh, Corey has a Zach Martini SES where the Martini glass is actually upside down on the side. He got it as a dud when we visited the Proto Factory. So, shout out Broussard. Uh, check out my Proto documentary up in the cards. Black headset spacer, Apex dust cover, because, you know, 6 wide equals Park AF. Native fork in black and chrome. Black Aztec Siren V2. I used to have the Urban Art 6 wide, but I traded. Sorry, I know I let you down, Boney gang. <laughs> I'm not Young Boney, okay? I don't run Young Boney. Or do I? <laughs> no, I don't. Or do I? Radix DTM Eagle Wheels. Black Skate Grip, because I'm broke and can't afford scooter grip tape. Also, scope the full deck grip tape job. Box cutting grip tape is small PP energy. <laughs> That is true. Anyone that's not gripping their deck end-to-end, -end, you're a total pleb, and do not submit to my scoot wars. My Instagram is at Balakey Wilson. Insert Balakey meme here. Balakey meme. Is that a thing? Balakey. <laughs> I don't get it. Also, shout out the homie from NZ, the notorious NTW. I recognize that at from somewhere. And use code Booter at the TVPS, or you're a... You're a what? You've not written anything after that. Next! Wagwan, boss man. I'm Credim from Wales. Uh, I sh bear sheep <laughs> and do bear inwards. Nice. Same. Minus the inwards. Hope you like my scooter as much as you like the Zooters. Mm, I hope so. You're gonna have to put a pretty big, uh, pretty big scooter in front of me to uh, com compete with that. Blunt TPR grips in black. Uh, Eclat? Eclat? BMX bar ends? Drone Max Peters Signature Titanium Bars. 27 tall by 24 wide. What's with the Supreme thing? All right, all you fake flexes, just know that this is a 100% authentic Supreme sticker. No cap. Good grief, that deck is bright. Tilt Arc SCS in black. Ethic uh, Nemesis 12 Standard Fork in black. Tilt Integrated Headset. 
Urban Art 120mm disc wheels with custom teal and white paint job. You did a pretty good job on that, man. Uh, Ethic Volcane deck with the same teal colorway. Ethic Breakless foot fender. And uh, clear grip tape with... What is that? I don't know, some bird. Hope you enjoyed my scooter. You... <laughs> what the f*** is this? Is that a jewel? <laughs> this is what happens when you jewel, all right? You get one loose airlobe and beep beep that. <laughs> Happening, Brad? I'm Dan, I'm 19. I live in the land of the way, the glorious Newcastle upon Tyne in England. I don't know what any of that means, but I'm assuming you sound really cool right now. Setup's a bit beat up, but uh, I got some decent parts. Here they are. Okay. Entity Pro, black titanium bar ends. Bars, Logic titanium wire bars, spray painted black. The grips, uh, I believe are Aztec grips. Entity Pro Bio SCS with titanium bolts. I think Entity's gonna send some of these new parts out to me as well, so I'll let you guys know a little bit more about how they perform later on in future videos. Uh, headset, BSD, tall stack headset. Urban Art 6x23 V4 bone deck. Not your SIG though, lol. And it has a uh, heli crusty purple paint job. Yeah, what's with the, what's with the Sharpie? <laughs> Attic Relentless Fork. Uh, Eagle X Addict Holocore Radix Wheels 115 and the hardness is medium and your scooter's making my PP hardness hard AF. Decent setup, few rarely seen parts. My Insta's at Dan Gattins. Shout out to Entity Pro and Rider Design. Yes, hell yes, I support that. Also check out my 2019 video part, Empire, on my YouTube channel, which is at Dan Gattins. Shlalom Jackie. Is that offensive? It better not be. Actually, I don't care. Next! Hello, Scooter Brad. My name is David. I ordered this whole scooter on the Vault Pro Scooters using code Booter for 10%. Oh, here we go again. Ooh, uh, my Insta is at double triple underscore chud. <laughs> okay. And shout out to my boy, Timothy Banco. Part list. Here we go. Envy Union tie bars. I don't think we've seen any Union tie bars on the show thus far, but here we are. Uh, Aztec Hydra deck. Big flex, big expenny, mate. So are those tie bars. This is what I'm saying when I say the most, the best, most expensive scooters in the game, man. Uh, Ethic Scythe double clamp. Ethic mixed colored grips. Why have you put all of your parts out of order from top to toe? I don't know. God, this scooter is fuego, dude. What the frick? Aztec Circa V2 fork. This is a very nice looking fork. Uh, Odyssey headset. Aluminium bar ends, uh, Root Industries Liberty wheels, which are apparently made in the United States, or so they claim, but I'm not too sure about that because they won't tell us who actually pours them. What I'm thinking is that the cores are made in China and then they ship them to America to get poured, but I don't know because they don't disclose that information to their customers, which I find rather fishy. Root Industries, please respond. Next! Quite a nice scooter that was. Hello, Scootonkly Broadly. <laughs> Uh, my name is Daniel. I'm from the good old UK. I recently broke my leg. Uh, X-ray included. Wow. X-ray wars? Ethic grips. Black. Root Industries bar ends. District AL 115 bars. These are super unpopular at the moment, which is cool. So you've got some originality there. I like it. Uh, Envy double clamp in black. Glad it's not neochrome. Core headset with MFX Mad Gear IHC dust cover. Uh, MGP array fork from the MFX range. Uh, Ethic Pandemonium deck, 20.9 by 4.7 wide in matte black. Enough skateboard grip tape, which he didn't do end-to-end -end because he is lazy. And Eagle Sports X6 wheels, white and black. Hope you like my scoot, as I think it's fire. Also, quick plug for the gram, at that boy, that zule. Also, Toby likes men and his boyfriend's name is Steven. On you, mate. Would you mind introducing us? Oh god, you've really done- you've done a number on yourself here, haven't you, mate? Smash like for Daniel's broken leg. Next. Hey, Scooter Brad, my name is Hayden Kennison. I have decided to send in two scooters at the same time. Oh my goodness. They are both mine, and I thought I might as well just send both of them together. Well, you know, two birds, one stone, and all that jazz. I really love my scooters. I think they look amazing. I hope you do too. I hope I do three. Oh boy, now that's a cool picture. Ethic Grips, clear, Proto Retro V3 T-bars in black, 30 high, 22.5 wide. Big tall boys, these are. Native Orca SCS clamp in black and raw. Bunch of headset spaces on the top of a Proto headset. Native Versa forks in gray. 
Protozac Martini Sig Gripper Wheels, North Atlas Theorem Deck in black, 5.75 wide by 22 and a half long, uh, with a black native fender. This deck could use a paint, but you know, whatevs. Flavor Grips, gum colored, uh, native T-bars, 26 high by 22 and a half. Roared to let them rust. That's very cool, as long as you did it intentionally. Wise headset, uh, the dust caps upside down. Okay, <laughs> why? <laughs> Native Flamongo V2 fork in raw. Proto plasma wheels, very sick. That's why you can see through the wheel here. That's very cool. I like this picture very much. North Atlas Novus deck, 5.5 by 22 with a raw native fender. Again, with the North deck and uh, native fender. That's very cool. Thank you in advance. If I made it into Scoot Wars, my Insta's at HeyDocino and uh, follow Adelaide Scooter Scene 2. Cool. Hope you have a good day slash night and don't forget to use code Buddha for 10% off at the Volpro Scooters. Everyone knows already. Okay, shut up. Next. Sorry, was that shut up a little bit rude? Deal with it. Hello, Mr. Spooter Spreadly. My name is uh, Elias. Uh, this is my new setup, and I believe it's one of the lightest setups in the world. Oh, okay, big claims here. Oh, yep, no doubt about it. I recognize this bedroom. Not because I've been in it. Tilt Metro Grips. Good grief, those are so light, am I right? Uh, District Titanium Bars. Ethic Scythe Double Clamp. He is a true weight weenie, as you can see. <laughs> Aztec Circa Fork, Blunt Headset, the Aztec Hydra Deck, another Hydra Deck, very cool, I like it. It's a very expensive deck, no doubt. Root Honeycore Wheels, uh, green on black, and enough skate grip tape, just plain black. And at least he did it end to end, because he's not lazy. Although it doesn't look that hard to do on a deck like this. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram at Elesnovi, and have a good day. P.S. Sub to PewDiePie. Uh-huh, I'm already subbed. Unlike 12 accounts did. Hello, Scooter Brad, my name is Hayden. I'm from the central coast of Australia. I saw your previous videos and thought that my setup would be a good contender for the show. Parts are the following. Black ODI bar ends with ODI grips. Scooter Heart Titanium T-bars, 650 mil tall by 600 mil wide. Lucky headset, no top cap because we weight weenie gang. Black Envy IHC CNC forks. They're practically long way forks that, you know, it's the same bloody thing. Original, bro. Oh. Purple Apex deck, 4.5 by 19.3. My goodness, that is very short. Apex logo grip tape and uh, Envy Holocore wheels. Very nice. Hopefully I made the show. Be sure to follow my Instagram at Hayden Palsy. Pal Palsy. Have an amazing day. You too. That's what I say at the end of the video. Don't, not, not, not yet. We're not there yet. Next! Last one, incoming. Hi, Scooter Brad. I'm Elia. I just a Russian boy from Spain. Wait, what? How does that work? I enjoy riding and watching your vids about two years recently. I got some parts and think that my booty is good enough to be in Scoot Wars. In Soviet Russia, you do not ride scooters. Scooter ride you. It's amazing what playing Call of Duty Black Ops will do for your Russian accent impersonation. Ethic Grips, Affinity XL Bars, Root Industries SCS Clamp Chrome. Apex 5 wide deck in raw, looking very nice. Still pretty fresh, or relatively fresh, I should say. Uh, Reese de Mosa Signature River Wheels, Tilt Headset, Apex Quantum Forks. Uh, a very cool grip tape. What is that grip tape? What, have you not put it on here? I want to know what brand that is. What is that? Skate Pro. Okay. And, uh, that's it, bro. Hopefully you like my scooter and sorry for the vertical clip. Vertical content? I just wanted to show you. Here is my Instagram page, at Voktivist. Thank you and goodbye. Goodbye, my friend. That is it for today's submissions for Scoot Wars. Guys, don't go anywhere. I'm going to show you a quick montage of riding clips and the scooters more in detail. Afterwards, you'll then be able to vote. You guys know the drill, right? Up in the cards after the montage. Here we go.
Thank you guys all so much for flooding my inbox with your submissions. We've got some very, very good submissions recently, so keep them coming. Get those four videos, four photographs, all landscape mode, and you can add extra writing clips if you want to be featured in the montage. Okay, that's very good. Now it's time to vote. Cast your vote, smash like, leave a comment down in the comment section of what you think would be nice for the channel, whether you want to see writing videos, yada, yada, yada. I promise next week, weather providing, I will go out and make some writing videos because I haven't done it for a little minute now. I owe you guys some scooter vlogs. But anyway, that's it from me. It's been your boy, FinSB. Tell a friend about the channel or something. We're going to build this community and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Have an amazing day. Cat, stop licking my foot. Do you think your custom build scooter is better than the ones that you've seen today? Well, if you think so, make sure you submit it via wetransfer.com to the email address scooterbrad at gmail.com. You can send in a minimum of four photographs, four videos, all in landscape mode, like this video you see right here. No tall portrait photos, okay? God. Anyone that submits portrait content will be eliminated from the voting system and you will not be eligible for winning the prize. Okay, is that clear? Thank you very much. Please include your name, your part list, and your Instagram name that you want to get shouted out, and that is pretty much that. <laughs>